What's up guys, Chris here from Mainly Mesh. Gonna be talking about this awesome True Comp 4.0 shaft that they were kind enough to send me. They sent me an awesome uh, Lacrosse Unlimited kind of declaration of independence themed version. It says, we the people, in order to form a more perfect team, establish justice, all, all the good stuff, the declaration of lax dependence awesome looking shaft got that cool old school paper look um, I threw this shaft on a bunch of different heads a bunch of low whip heads a bunch of high whip heads ended up really working it in with a Brian King with that hero mesh pattern that really whips just so I could really test out the flex of it it is a six flex compared to the five flexes that are usually on the markets I would say that maybe one to five percent of you would be able to feel the flex difference it was something that I wasn't feeling in any of the lower whip heads. And then when I put on an incredibly high whip head, I might have seen a two mile an hour boost. Um, and that was by the time I was shooting 95 plus. So, so it's a very slight difference, but it's a very responsive stick. Um, the flex is um, just very consistent. It feels a little bit softer to me, which was neat you know really got to wind up and, and crank with this thing but very standard the same grip that the c30s do the same grip that the 2014 ecd carbons had just you know very simple concavity the the classic octagonal shape there so nothing new nothing that blew me away i was kind of expecting true to come out with their first shaft either at a lower price point than the hundred dollars on the market or with some crazy technology but instead they kind of gave us a very solid $110 option. So for right now, I'm going to have to stick with my boys and the ECD carbon, you know, with their unique concavities or, or go a little bit more responsiveness with the, with the dragonflies and a unique geometry. I mean, ECD carbon, they changed up their, their geometry a little, so it's not an entirely stereotypical octagonal shape, but, but, before you guys think I'm closing the book on True, I could not be more intrigued by what they've been teasing with, with the loading zone technology. I've been dying to see what would happen if you had a kick point with an octagonal shaped shaft. I don't know if that's what, we're, what they're doing. I have no inside information there, so I don't want to, you know, put any words in their mouth that aren't true. But very solid option coming out from True Lacrosse if you like their look go for it, you're not gonna be disappointed in any way, shape, or form. It's very strong, very light, same weight as, as pretty much everything else, but I am giddy with excitement for their next version. Praying every every night in bed for, for a tester, because that's totally what you should be praying about when you're my age, but we'll see what happens. Thank you again to True Lacrosse. Thank you guys. Please comment any more questions you have down below. I mean, it's very, you know, I'm probably going to be giving you rudimentary answers, but but we'll see. Like, subscribe. Thank you guys so much, and I will be catching you guys next time.